Hi everyone. Over the course of the past six months or so, we've made all the effort to double the size of our our vegetable garden. But before we showed you this this current status where we've enlarged everything, I thought it would be nice to give you an overview of what we've done with the garden since we moved into the house. It was uh, about a 12 by 12 vegetable garden with lots of wire mesh fencing around it and uh, a lot of vines growing on it. Some of them were grape vines, some of them were star cuke, which is a, a wild cucumber relative. But it was a, it was a mess, uh, very shady. There was a lot of big, big trees uh, directly to the south of the garden, so it never got quite enough sun. So uh, it took a couple years. I didn't have a chainsaw when we moved in or anything like that, and we had plenty of projects to do around the house. So the garden sat, unfortunately, for about two years before we really, really got it wrapped up and, uh, and working. But this is just kind of shows our progress through, through the entire process. Uh, we started out, you know, first clearing uh, brush and crud out of the garden. Uh, a lot of the things on the north side of the garden was uh, wild blueberry, so I had to tear up an enormous patch of wild blueberry, which was a little bit sad. But fortunately, we do have a ton of it, so there's plenty still left. But uh, yeah, it was removing enormous amounts of rocks and roots and all sorts of crap and uh, all the old timbers and fencing and just junk that was laying around to kind of clear things out and start start fresh. We expanded the originally 12 by 12 garden to about 30 by 16 or so. Um, we didn't have a lot of manure or anything like that to, to mix in. We were making kitchen compost, but weren't really making enough of it. So as I was pulling weeds, I was actually layering the garden with six or eight inches of leaf mold uh, on top just to qu quench all the weeds out, keep new weeds from forming, and uh, obviously to amend amend the soil. So every every time I would, you know, pull a four foot or five foot stretch of, you know, blueberries, for example, out, I would, you know, turn it, turn it all, dig out all the rocks, dig up any roots, and then mulch it over immediately with leaf mold. And uh, I kind of picked at it over about two years before it was all said and done. Um, at the end of the two years, I went through and uh, trimmed a whole bunch of trees on the south side of the garden to give, give it much more sun and started erecting a fence. I just used some pressure-treated posts that we stained and uh, wrapped everything up with nice six-foot-tall fencing. It's buried a little bit under the dirt, so it's about five feet tall or so when uh, all is said and done to keep the deer out, and uh, that's about that. But uh, as I said, this year we're expanding. Or actually, it's all, we're almost complete now. I'm working through the fencing at this moment. But uh, we're going to have uh, about 30 by 30, 30 by 32 when all is said and done. And uh, it's looking great. So I just wanted to kind of give you this background before we show you this next stage that we're, we're currently working on. A fun little tidbit I actually wanted to share here at the end was the difference in uh, the size of our rock pile next to our garden. When we first started, there was there was a rock pile, but it was uh, just just a, a slight mound where they took the blasted material out of our house and pushed it all into the back. But it's kind of fun to look at it between the first and last stages of uh, of our first garden expansion or revitalization, I guess is the best word, uh, to see exactly how many rocks we actually dug out of the soil. It's kind of tremendous even to me, and I dug them all by hand with a shovel so it's uh it's just kind of fun to, to to notice the difference but uh that was about it um i hope you enjoyed this video uh we're, our new garden like i said is coming along great so we will be posting a video very soon i just have to put a little bit more fencing up and uh plant some plant some veg so we'll share our progress and what we did to amend the new expanded garden so thanks for watching. Please comment, ask any questions you might have. If you like our channel, please subscribe. Thanks a lot.